How's it going, guys? Luis here with New Tech News Intel. There has been a rumor, there has been a leaked tablet of Intel's sixth generation processor, which packs a few surprises. According to digitaltrends.com, uh, there has been a leaked uh, there's been there has been leaked info for this new processor and it's going to be uh, it's going to be released here soon at the end of this year maybe around that time but it's called the Skylake and uh, it says it's going to bring new performance levels according to Chinese blog Bench Life that's where it got leaked from it will launch with a small run of Core i5 and Core i7 processors and three different power ratings so these processors are actually going to be lower um, they're gonna have lower power ratings and that's what's gonna make them uh, a lot better they're gonna follow the same naming convention as uh, the past um, processors for example here it's gonna be called core i5 6600T which is designed for ultra power consumption the kind you might find in a home theater PC these are rated for a thermal design power of 35 watts and uh, in this article, I will post a link on the description of the video for this article if you want to take a look at all the specs here. But uh, it looks like the new um, T's that I'm talking about are down here. And all these other ones uh, looks like the Core i7 6700K uh, is one of the best ones you can get. But it uses a lot of uh, watts. All right, guys, so these new processors are going to use uh, fewer watts. That's pretty much uh, the difference. Intel needs to change their li their naming lineup. I'm getting, I don't know, i5, i7, i3. They need to change it up a little bit. They just keep making the same name, i7 or i5, with a different uh, name in the end here. But, I mean, the name doesn't really matter. What matters is the difference in technology, right? So this new technology is going to have lower power consumption alright guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you soon in a new tech news